Morning everyone. And yes, it is day number six of plowing snow. I don't have too much to do. I have to finish up the parking lot that I started yesterday. I got called away because the plows went through and plugged all these driveways up. I have uh, a rental unit that there's nobody in. I have to open that driveway up and the sidewalks and everything. And then I have uh, one lady's uh, access to her back door and her, uh, I guess her backyard and everything that she wants all cleaned up, what I do every time. That's the only ones I have to do today. Um, I slept in this morning because I knew it was going to be cold out. And I should have turned the video around because someone just went by on a scooter. So people are wanting to be outside. So anyhow, I am going to uh, go finish that parking lot up. It's not going to be a night or uh, it's not going to be easy. It's just going to be a nightmare because I have to do the lower half, which is shaded a lot, and uh, it's going to be hard pushing because there's about a foot of snow or so in that area. And it's just uh, going to be tough pushing because it's going to be a little icy underneath that first when I first open it up. So hopefully it won't take much to get that opened up. And I'm not going to get all crazy with it. I just got to get it open enough, opened up enough so if somebody's uh, looking at buying this building, uh, they can take a look at it. Because you never know when the person that's going to be potentially buying is driving through. So as soon as I get to that parking lot, I'll get you set up and then we'll go from there.
Well, the parking lot's done, but I didn't think this through very good. I gotta get to that camera now. Oh boy. Okay, that was actually kind of funny. The parking lot's done and let's see. Let's start over. So that was actually kind of funny there. I set the camera up to get the best shot I could get. And uh, you know, I was trying to protect it, so I put it behind a snow bank. Well by the time I got on pushing the snow, uh, the front of the snow bank where I was pushing to the back of it where the camera was it was about 10 foot so yeah I made for a good video but I got wet feet now or from snow going over the boost but that's okay it's uh it was kind of funny I thought I'm sure someone else is gonna make a comment but that was it was still funny so I'm on to the next driveway where I have to use a snow blower just because I'm not gonna be able to push it I usually plow it out, but I can't do it. There's no way I'm going to backplate any of this, and it's just a small driveway. So, And if uh, the neighbor plows snow into the driveway, I'm not going to be able to do much with it. So we'll see what happens, and then I'll just do that uh, little, uh, let's see. Yeah, I'll just do that, that driveway there, and then I'll go to one more yard that I'm supposed to have done there, or the side of the garage and everything. So we'll see what happens with these. Okay, change of plans again. I just got a message. The plows went through and plugged all the freaking driveway shut again. Oh, I'm so sick and tired of this crap. And this stuff is melting fast, and they just keep pushing the snow back, push the snow back, push the snow back. And then I have to keep going back and open up these damn driveways again. Okay, I got all the ends of the driveways open back up. It wasn't as bad as the person led me to believe. So they just uh, got a couple of driveways uh, near corners. They're making the corners, uh, or fixing the corners, I should say. And I went to go do that uh, one driveway left that I had to do as a rental, and the plow went through there once, and that driveway has got a lot of snow. Actually, the whole road's got a whole big old pile of snow everywhere, and the, them people are still all snowed in. I drove in and backed out because I couldn't even turn around. So um, that's just gonna have to wait. And I don't know. I don't know when they're gonna get that down there, but um, I gotta wait for the plow to finish down there because they just got a huge mess down there. So I'm just gonna go finish the one little bit I have left and call it a day. So and it's gonna be a nice break for me. I'll be able to get a little more rest and uh, edit some more video because I'm uh, what? I think I got. Yeah, I don't know. I'm behind out of editing anyhow. I think I have one more video to edit from two days ago and then this one. So uh, I'll just make it all work. Or, yeah, I'll just get all that. I'll get all my editing caught up and get all. Uh, I haven't done any of my billing, so that's got to all be done. That's going to be. What do we got? Four days of billing or fun? No, five days of billing I have to do. And some of these bills that these customers are going to get is not going to be good. Because I've been to some of these places like three and four times. And, you know, they keep calling and I keep going and opening them up. So, I know it's going to be a big bill for them, but it's going to be nice little startup money for us, I guess. Because we got all our insurances, our, our liability insurance, and our car insurances are due, and everything's due this uh by the end of this month so that's gonna help pay for all the insurances so I'm gonna go finish that a uh, little area up there and uh, maybe I'll be able to drop the camera there I'm not sure yet so we'll see what happens and then I'll get back with you as soon as I'm done with it okay that is it for the snow removal for today I couldn't uh, set a camera out with me snow blowing because the wind picked up too much and the camera wouldn't have stayed up and uh, I didn't snow blow very much anyhow because I can't do much with it. I made a few passes in there wide enough uh, for the person 
to get in and out of there without any problems but it's just a struggle to get anything because it's so deep and wet and icy and everything so uh, they did give us a grand total of how much snow we got uh, we got a total of 31 inches of snow and that's just way too much snow for April there's about 30 inches too much to where normally we should be getting so I don't care what you have 30 inches of snow is a lot for anybody to handle or 31 inches of snow it's just uh, just too much snow and then you add rain on top of that and warm temperatures it's just a big big mess and a lot a lot of work so so hopefully the next video you see me making or putting up will be uh, me finishing up my trailer which I'm hoping to get to Monday because I believe it's supposed to be 60 degrees on Monday. And then uh, everything should be, well, it's gonna be hit and miss for a couple weeks on what videos I do have up, cause uh, I'm gonna be waiting. But as soon as this starts uh, snow disappearing, I'm gonna have to go do uh, repairs of all the driveways or the edges of the driveways where I tore up with the plow. So that is figured in the price of my snow removal. So I'll be doing that for oh, probably about two to three days, just uh, fixing, you know, the, the the places where everything got tore up. So um, that is going to be ending my video for today. Uh, thank you for watching and subscribing. You can check out the links in the description box; it'd be greatly appreciated. Everybody have a good evening, and we will see you at the next yard.